The federal government claims the state of North Dakota actually profited from the Dakota Access Pipeline protests in the federal trial over who should pay the $38 million for protest response. Attorneys claim that the money the state borrowed from the Bank of North Dakota, which is state-owned, will be paid back with interest, which the bank can either keep as a profit or deposit back into the general fund. The state says that's not the case. Not all of the money has been paid back, and profit is offset by operating costs for the bank. The federal government also stated not all the protest camps were on core land, and many of the caravans were coming from other areas.